Let me show you. Oh, good. It's nasty outside. It's lousy. New York City weather. Yep. Everything is in there. My name is Michelle Cruz. I'm from El Barrio. My parents are from Puerto Rico. I grew up here uh, in East Harlem and I live in East Harlem. I opened East Harlem Cafe about two and a half, almost three years ago. I love my community. I'm very active in my community and I love coffee. I love jazz. I love reading books um, and I love giving back to my community. I love coffee. Uh, it's a culture, family. Uh, we drink coffee when we were happy, when we were sad. Uh, problem solving, it's just, it was a family tradition. But to start your own business, it must take a lot of capital. Can you explain or expand on what it took for you to actually start your business financially? Yeah, it took a lot more than what I had, which was about $684.05. Uh, in the bank account and I remember thinking like how am I gonna get I needed over probably you know 200,000 and I I thought for a second like should maybe I this isn't the dream for me and maybe I should just give it up um, so that 684 turned into a lot with you know the passion and the drive that I had for my dream to come true in the process of starting up, was there ever a time when you felt this may not become a reality? Yeah, every day. Every day when I was creating it. Um, I think, you know, uh, one of the main um, things was lack of capital um, and lack of resources. Um, so, you know, but, you know, even growing, uh, trying to do the construction and, and stuff there, every day when I thought, like, oh my goodness, what am I doing? Can you share with us a moment when fear was an obstacle in establishing your business? There are so many. <laughs> uh, but, you know, there's, there are so many. Uh, but there's this thing that I do when um, I feel like I can't, I'm not going to overcome an obstacle. Um, this little ritual I have where I, I go to a quiet place, whether it's the bathroom um, or room, and I, uh, there's a song by LL Cool J. Um, called Mama Said Knock You Out, and there's this part where he says, I'm gonna take this itty bitty world by storm and I'm just getting warm. And that helps me, I repeat that over and over again until I feel comfortable to take on whatever obstacles in front of me. I've noticed that the decor in here is beautiful and the artwork stands out. Can you tell me a little bit about the artwork on the walls here? Absolutely, this is one of the ways we give back uh, to our community, our local artist, Manny Vega. Um, and this is some of his inspirations. That's uh, Benny More, uh, his godmother, um, and Tito Puente, who needs no introduction. But it's, he's been actually instrumental in my journey. And, uh, you know, as I mentioned, the cafe is an extension of myself and, you know, learning my culture and um, my history here. Uh, because the, the East Harlem Cafe is you know, a taste of culture and it gives a little bit of the history of East Harlem. Are you ready to taste the best coffee in the world? Sure am. Thank you. Delicious. For many, a uh, cafe is a place to grab a latte, espresso. Can you tell me your plans to redefine the perception of a cafe? Absolutely. I think most traditional cafes um, consider themselves a the third place where folks drink lattes, hang out. East Harlem Cafe is more of an extension of our community or an extension of our family. 